7 problem solvers working for you. A few weeks ago, Michael Schwartz got the heat turned on for a woman who said she hadn't had it for more than a year. This morning, he's at it again, trying to help another woman who's been without heat for two weeks. The temperature outside Terry Johnson's East Buffalo home, not much different than inside. It feels like a freezer. Johnson called seven problem solvers about the broken boiler in her home that she rents. She said her landlord hasn't been helpful in fixing it. It's very frustrating because it's cold, it's winter. Johnson tells me it's been like this for close to two weeks. Cords run through her living room connecting to space heaters, but it remains chilly in the entire house. The thermostat while I was there, reading 49 degrees. It's so cold in this home that just about everywhere you go right now, you could see your breath. I have health issues. I have um, respiratory problems that I'm dealing with on top of being in the cold, trying not to catch pneumonia. This is how you're living. This is how I'm living. I'm seeing my breath right now in this home. It's 49 degrees. I called her landlord who is based in New York City. They should be in a hotel right now. <laughs> they, this, is, this is ridiculous to live like this. In Buffalo? The landlord tells me a repairman did come one night, but Johnson says she was already in bed. What can the man do at 7 o'clock at night? There's no stores open to get no parts. In the following days, the landlord said multiple technicians came out, later determining the boiler needed a new igniter part. He says no stores in the Buffalo area had the part, so he had to order it directly from the manufacturer, carrier. And the good news this morning, that part came in just a few hours after I first met with Johnson, and she now has heat once again. Michael Schwartz, 7 Problem Solvers, East Buffalo. Michael, thank you. So if you have a problem you need help with, let Michael investigate and find answers. Email him at 7problemsolvers at wkbw.com. So